I would like to do a, a later presentation um, in more detail, but I just felt it was more important to get this one out. Um, okay, so materiality, the things that matter. The, the threshold, the materiality as a concept uh, comes from an accounting background. Um, some of you will be familiar, but and it, and it is directly applied in in some way. Um, so you know the materiality or, or something that's considered material for for you know Westpac is maybe five hundred million dollars to to move the button to being material. Um, Obviously, that spices right down, and what's material for a small cap is a lot lower than that. Um, you know, the Royal Commission, in a sense, is all about, or it can be looked at through a lens of being all about um, all the things that that can happen when you have a threshold that high. Um, there's just a lot of places you can hide the body, so to speak. The ASX has this neat little diagram um, that just shows, um, you know, essentially just the, the tree, basically. Um, and this is simplified even further. This might be a bit hard to see. But um, anyway, it's just what I've read out. These are just some examples in Guidance Note 8 around the sorts of things that are always material. Um, and... You know, and like there's any number of varieties, but and it's definitely not um, exclusive to this. But you know, uh, material acquisition or disposal is pretty obvious. Um, mineral and hydrocarbon discovery, obviously relevant if you're an explorer or you're in a in the oil. Um, you know, it's it's not rocket science. So imagine that significant change in nature or scale would trigger that, but. Um, you know, the variation or termination of a material agreement, you know, that gets a lot of companies. Um, and, and it's also that human nature of wanting to say, hey, we've got this contract, we've, we've entered into this great news, um, but then when it falls away or, it, or it's terminated, then, um, then often that, that announcement is, is not there or it's buried somewhere. 